good day. Um, this video has been shot in, in my kitchen again. Um, I'm going to just show you how I uh, how I um, dry corn. Um, simple procedure, but uh, I think it helps for some people who haven't done it to actually be able to see the whole thing. Um, so that's what we're going to do today. Um, I've already got a fair bit hanging up um, and uh, I'm just on the last few cobs now so uh, I'll carry on with that. Tying these up with string, you don't need a very, very long piece um, but don't make it too short and give yourself a hard time. You have to tie a little loop in the end just like a lariat or a lasso if you like. So we have a loop in one end. Take the corn, strip it down. like that up that isn't too good. Just cut it off before you hang it up. Take the noose, put it around the around the end, pull it tight. I usually hang these up one at a time, but um, as soon as we're uh, doing it here on video, I'll do a few. Don't pull too hard down on these, or she'll break them off. Just a simple loop, tied in the end. Around the end of the corn, pull it tight. Some are more fragile than others, as you can see. I pulled a whole heap off there that I didn't really want to do. Probably because I'm working faster than I normally would. You know, tie the loop. Getting low, getting down to one. Whilst I've still got a piece of the length I want, I'll uh, just measure that off. Cut another one.
we've had our first light frosts already, so I hope to bring our pumpkins in today. I don't want them getting frosted. A bit of last over winter, or oh, a good part of it anyway. I've got in the dresser. These should dry nice for here. Of course they'll dry quicker when I've got the heater going. Um, if I could be guaranteed of some sun, uh, I'd have them hanging outside. And uh, when I was up at the uh, when I was up at the old cottage, just up the hill from here, uh, we'd hang them on the veranda. could uh, shut the corn, cut the corn off, um, put it on trays and uh, dry it that way too. Um, in, the, uh, in an open oven on the wood burning stove uh, or on top of it in drying racks. Um, but my drying racks are all uh, um, full of banana and uh, apple and, and plums at the moment drying out so and I've got a heap of pumpkin to do as well okay that's it